Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're embarking on a colorful journey through Japan's traffic lights and uncovering the unique story of why green is also blue in this fascinating country. You see, in most parts of the world, we learn from a young age that red means stop and green means go. It's a universal understanding, right? Well, not exactly. Our story begins centuries ago when the Japanese language had words for just four primary colors, black, white, red, and blue. As we know it today, green didn't have its own distinct term. Instead, the Japanese used ao for both blue and green. This linguistic system worked well until around the end of the first millennium. As time passed, a new word emerged in Japanese, midori, originally meaning sprout, began to describe the color we now know as green. But even then, midori was considered a shade of ao, creating linguistic nuances that persist in Japan. In modern Japan, you can still find objects labeled ao, blue, that in reality are green. This linguistic quirk extends to everyday life, from ao ringo, blue apples, to aodaki, blue bamboo. Now, let's shift our focus to Japan's traffic lights. Initially, they were undeniably green, but official traffic documents continued to use ao, rather than midori, to describe them. International traffic regulations require go signals to be represented by green lights, creating a linguistic inconsistency. In response to these linguistic concerns, the Japanese government made a remarkable decision in 1973. Through a cabinet order, they mandated that traffic lights should use the bluest possible shade of green. This allowed them to maintain using the word ao while adhering to international traffic regulations. So, the next time you find yourself in Japan and encounter what appears to be blue traffic lights, remember this unique compromise. These blue lights are, in fact, a vivid shade of green, deeply rooted in Japan's linguistic history and commitment to tradition. Thank you for joining us on this colorful exploration of Japan's traffic lights. If you enjoyed this journey, don't forget to like and subscribe for more enlightening tales from around the world. And remember, when you see blue in Japan, it means, go!